Okay, good morning class. So uh, today we're looking at part mass fractions. Okay. So those are actually have drawn up in uh, it was 2018, but drawn up before that already in 2016 or 14 there. Okay. But uh, we have done the bottom mass primarily, okay? So this is the extension thereof, okay? Now we're going to include some fractions into this calculation. So we're looking at book A and worksheet 1. So the first sum was, it was fairly easy to start you off with. You've got 5 minus in brackets, 3 minus 1. So what do that become? 5, the brackets must be done first according to bottom mass. Not so. So it's going to be minus, 3 minus 1 is? Two. And 5 minus 2 is? 3. You all okay with that? Let's look at number 3. In number 3, we've got multiplication and? And uh, brackets. Not so. And in the brackets, we have addition. So it must be done first. The brackets. So you still multiply. But what's 5 plus 4? 9. What's 2 times 9? 18. Okay. Carry on, number five. We've got 12 minus in brackets, 10 plus 2. So we've got subtraction and brackets, not so? Yes, so it must be done first? Brackets. brackets. So in the bracket we've got addition, so 10 plus 2 is? 12. 12, 12 minus 12? 7. Alright. Number 7. We have 5 plus 13 divided by 3. In brackets, 5 plus 13. So we got brackets and division. So what have we done first? Brackets. brackets. In the bracket, we got addition. So 5 plus 13 is? 18. 18 divided by 3 is? 6. Okay. Number 9. So here we got 10 multiplied by. 3 divided by 5 in brackets. So according to what mass, what must be done first between multiplication and division? And multiplication and brackets? The brackets. So it's 10 multiplied by. This 3 divided by 5 can be written as 3 over 5. But 10 is naturally over? Is there anything that we cancel here? 5 goes into 5 once, 5 going to 10. It gives you an answer of 2 times 3, which is 6 over 1, which is? Any confusion there? Okay, number 11. But 12 multiplied by brackets, 2 divided by 3. So we've got brackets and multiplication. Okay, the link to the PDF can be found in the description box below. Okay. So the bracket needs to be done first. Not so. So it's going to be 12 multiplied by 2 divided by 3, three is 2 thirds. Not so. So we know 12 is naturally over 1. Is there anything you can cancel here? Yes. So 3 going to 3 once, 3 going to 12, 4 times. Anything there? 4 multiplied by 2 is 8 over 1, which is? Yes, Michael. Um, yesterday What's your name? Me. You're the only one talking. Okay. Um, my name is Sarah. Um, Sarah. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm trying to remember. Okay. Go for it. Um, so, yesterday when I asked you about the um, changing of the, of the numbers, is it like this? You can't change because I get the same answer. Yeah, so with regards to the question you asked yesterday, because you said you you remember that when we divide, you must change this to multiplication. That, that's what your question. No? So what I did was I said, okay, that's over 1 and that's over 1. We're going to change that to multiplication with tumble and times. So that's going to give you 12 multiplied by in brackets. We've got 2 over 1 multiplied by 1 over 3. Which then gives you 12 multiplied by, nothing cancels, 2 over 3. 
which now brings you to that point D. Can you see? So then it's the same from as before, 3 going to 3, 1, 3 going to 12, 4 times, to 4 over 1, uh, sorry, um, 8 over 1, which is it. Same answer. So what did you do wrong? Okay, at the end of the second, you just bring your book and I'll explain to you where you're going around, okay? At the end. Okay. So we can just finish this up. I don't want the video to be too long, okay? Number 13. What's going to be done here? We've got division and brackets. So brackets first. So it's 15 divided by. 3 divided by 2, okay, better than this? 3 over 2. Naturally, that's over 1. We're going to change this to? Publication, tumble in times. So it will be 15 over 1 multiplied by 2 over 3. So 3 goes into 3 once, 3 going to 15? 5. 5 times 2 is 10 over 1, which is? Okay. Number 15. So you got 80 divided by brackets, 2 times 3. So the brackets first, not so. It's 18 divided by 6. It was 18 divided by 6. Did I need to change this to fractions or whatever? No. No. Very simple. No? Very simple. Number 17. We've got multiplication and subtraction. So what needs to be done here? Again, brackets. Not so? So it's 3 multiplied by 9. In the bracket, I have 1 minus a third. So when we're adding and subtracting, what do we do? We need to find an LCM. Not so? So 1 is naturally over 1. So what's the LCM between 1 and 3? Three? 3. So you can say it's 3 over 3. So you must multiply that by 3. And you must multiply this by 1. So 1 times 3 is 3. What's 1 multiplied by 1? And what is? Now because the denominators are the same, I can subtract the numerators. What's 3 minus 1? 2. So it's 2 thirds. Okay. So people, this is naturally over 1. 3 going to 3 ones, 3 going to 3 ones. 1 multiplied by 2 is? 2 over 1, which is? Okay. You'll see me later do this as well. Okay, when I have 3 multiplied by, and I find my LCM there to be 3. So I multiply the 1 by 3 to get 3. 1 times 3 is 3. Minus 1. Okay. You'll see me sometimes write it as one fraction like that. That and that is the same. Okay? So it's 3 multiplied by 2 over 3. That's naturally over 1. 3 and 3 ones. It'll be 2 over 1, which is. Okay? See, any confusion? Any confusion? Can you all see on your books? Can I put the light on? Huh? No. Okay. You can't see when they mean Number 19. So here we have brackets. My multiplication as well. So what must be done first? The brackets. Okay. So inside the bracket, what is your LCM? Okay. So 3 multiplied by what is 6? 2. So let's multiply the 2 so by 2. 6 multiplied by what is 6? 1. So what is 2 multiplied by 2? 4 minus 1 multiplied by 1? 1 multiplied by 4 over? You will agree with that. So what's 4 minus 1? 3. So it's 3 over? 6 multiplied by 4 over 1. Now you can say 4 times 3 is 12, and 12 divided by 6 is 2, okay? 
But the idea is to simplify before you multiply. Okay? The idea is to keep it small instead of making the sum bigger than what it needs to be. You guys understand? So we're going to first simplify before we multiply. So 3 goes into 3 once, 3 goes into 6. 2 goes into 2 once, 2 goes into uh, 4. Twice. So what is 1 multiplied by 2? Over 1 multiplied by 1. And 2 over 1 is? Who got that right? Oh, you, oh yeah, you were absent yesterday, no? You're not in the maths group? Um, I have a phone. Oh, you didn't have a phone. Where's your phone? Took it. Nice, I like it. Why did they take it off? You don't know? Because you old time on the phone, that's why. No? Yes. Right, so what's 10 divided by in brackets 2 plus 3? 2 plus, sorry, 3 plus 5. What needs to be done first? Brackets. So it's 10 divided by. What's 3 plus 5? 8. Now, 8 can't be divided into 10 without the remainder. Not so. So we can write this as 10 over 8. Not so. So what number goes into 10 and into 8 without the remainder? 2. So 2 goes into 10. 5 times. 2 goes into 8? 4 times. So the answer is 5 over 4. Or 1 and a quarter. Okay. I'm going to start leaving the answers in in proper form. Okay? Unless the question says the answer should be in mixed numbers, then you'll have to give it in, the, in that form. Number three. You got 3 multiplied by, in brackets you got 2 over 3 minus 7 over 12. You so watch your I'll see you inside the bracket. The bracket needs to be done first. 12. So I can drop the bracket because I have one fraction now. The only time you can drop the bracket if there's one number. Okay, one fraction. So what is the LC between 12 and 3? 12. 3 multiplied by what is 12? 4. You multiply it by 4. 12 multiplied by what is 12? So 2 times 4 is? Minus 1 times 7 is? Okay. So it's going to be 3 multiplied by 8 minus 7 is? 1 over? Now what? Sorry? Put the 3 over 1. Remember that whole number? Can be always the number one. Okay. Three going to three once, three going to twelve, four times. One multiplied by one is one. One multiplied by four is. Okay. Any confusion there? No? You get twenty five. We got division and brackets, so what must be done first? Brackets. There's one divided by, there's LCM inside the bracket is? 12. 3 multiplied by what is 12? 4. 12 multiplied by what is 12? So 1 multiplied by 4 is 4. 1 multiplied by 7 is 7. Okay, so it's going to be 1 divided by that's 4 plus 7? 11. 11 over? Four. So that must change to? Times. Multiplication. So I need to tumble in times. Not so. Yes. That's simply going to be 1 over 1 multiplied by 12 over? Do yes. anything get cancelled here? No. Remember, numerator and denominator? Cancel across the uh, multiplications. 1 multiplied by 12 is 12. 1 multiplied by 11 is 
Ang uso ko dito na tinas? 1 and 1 over 2. Number 27. Five over six multiplied by eight minus two. What needs to be done first? Brackets, not so. So it's five over six multiplied six eight minus two is six, and that six is over. Okay. Is there anything can cancel here? Simplify before multiply. Yes. 6 goes into 6 once, 6 goes into 6 once. 1 multiplied by 5 is? 5. 1 multiplied by 1 is 1. 5 over 1 is? 5. Okay. Is there any confusion here? Not yet. Okay, and then the last one of this worksheet is number 29. So what needs to be done first is division and bracket. So bracket needs to be done first. 2 multiplied by 9 is 18. Let's divide. Now, before we can change this to multiplication, this needs to be a improper fraction. Not so. So let's change um, 3 and uh, 3 fifths into improper. We multiply and we add. Not so. 50. 5 times 3 is? 15 plus 3, 18 over. So now we have 18 divided by 8 over 5. What's going to happen now? We'll change this to mix, uh, we'll uh, change multiplication, double and time. So that would simply be 18 divided by, sorry, 18 multiplied by. 5 over 18. People, so that naturally over. Is there anything can cancel here? 18 goes into 18 once, 18 goes into 18 once. 1 multiplied by 5 is over, which is 5. Okay. Any questions? No? Alright.